just found out that our film is completely sold out and we're just so giddy. This is just super exciting. But first off, we're gonna go pick up our film festival passes. Looks like you got some new merch. Well, we did. Uh, filmmakers, I guess, get hats, and they're just way cooler than I would thought. Highly coveted, too. Highly coveted. Obviously, I immediately put mine on my hat. We are 15 minutes away from the grand premiere of our movie, which is sold out. The world premiere, 344 tickets. We literally have people asking at the door trying to get tickets, which is just mind blowing. We've talked to so many people and I don't know if you can tell by the smile on my face, but we're so excited to be here. This is Maverick. We brought two dogs from the rescue, Maverick and Cleo, and they're gonna get to meet people. And this is just truly everything we dreamed of when we started this journey. I go where he goes. He makes the decisions. Our movie follows Tiffany Larson and the incredible team at the Mega Mountain Dog Rescue. So Tiffany is right over there. She's one of the most badass, incredible, amazing people I've ever had the privilege to meet. Hey Matt, show them your face on your butt. Hey Matt, come on. There you go, man. There we go. Good boy. Good boy. Okay. During the screening of our movie, our daughter Mila decided that she wanted to sing in the movie theater. So we went outside and watched half the movie like this. It was the second day of the film festival. We got up, hung out, got some breakfast, and then we went and saw the photographer. So it was the first two episodes of the series that's gonna be on National Geographic. It was super awesome. We received the Q&A. And then we went over to Apre, which is where a bunch of the like filmmakers and festival pass goers can go hang out and chat. So we met a bunch of other people that had films, uh, which was super awesome. And now we are just hanging out until um, until later tonight, but it is snowing here in Sun Valley today, uh, which has been great. We love the snow. Who's your friend? Bo. And somebody else up down here. Hi, Bo. This is my buddy. Um, excuse me? <laughs> With the remaining hours that we had in Sun Valley, it only made sense to spend them at Onega. Tiffany fed the dogs, and we provided food for the people. It was great to spend time with the people that we've been surrounded by for the last year and a half and reflect upon the documentary that we completed. Editor Nicola here. We realized we really didn't film quite as much as we thought we did, but we wanted to give you a quick wrap up of the whole film festival and how everything went for us. As we said in the video, we had a sold out show. We opened the Sun Valley Opera House. We were the first movie there on Wednesday and we had a sold out theater, which was absolutely incredible. We had a lot of people reach out to us and come up to us actually after the screening in tears, asking how they can get involved. And, and that, that was why we did it, to educate people and to bring awareness to this incredible organization and to this cause. Although it would have been awesome to win some awards, we didn't come home with any awards. But what we did come home with was so many people reaching out and asking how they can get involved with the organization and what we can do to change the laws that surround these dogs. And honestly, if you ask me, I'll trade any award for that. We did have some people reach out to us regarding distribution, so that's in the works. But in the meantime, we do have two screenings that are currently being planned. There's gonna be one screening in Boise, Idaho, and one screening in Bellevue, Washington. If you'd like to get information once those screenings get solidified, make sure to leave a comment below so that we can add your name to the list. The last step that we have for the documentary is we are planning on submitting it to a handful more film festivals to, again, just get the word out there and try and educate people as best as we can. 
To everybody who's been with us on this journey that started back in November of 2022, thanks for sticking around. We can't wait to see what the future holds, and I guess we'll see you guys in the next project.